Okay, so this is Electra's other three kittens, all girls, all charcoals, because mom's a dark charcoal silver, dad's a light charcoal silver, and that's why the majority of all these kittens are silver, and some of them are light charcoal, and some of them are dark charcoal. Again, the biggest difference between light and dark charcoal is, well, how dark are you talking about here? The masks on dark charcoals are so much darker. The rosettes are so much darker. They're more like black spots as opposed to actual rosettes. Where light charcoals, you can still see a difference inside the rosette. It is still a little bit lighter. Um, and you can see it better in certain lighting than other lighting. Um, this is our big chunky silver charcoal girl. She's definitely a light charcoal. Um, this one right here is Dahlia. I love Dahlia. Dahlia was like one of my favorites when she was a kitten. I mean, you could really see the spacing of those rosettes. Gorgeous, really well spaced. I love how white that background color is. Um, very little ticking. So what ticking is, is when the white part is not completely white, the tips of the hair is a different color, so that's called ticking. So here's the other side. Again, really nice, well spaced, really white, white background. I love that, it helps it pop. You can see that the cape has since receded since she was a kitten. You can see that you, the rosettes are starting to show up more down the back. So I love that. Um, you can definitely see a lot of white on her face. It looks like you got scratched up there a little bit on your muzzle. The kittens, um, they can certainly scratch each other up big time. I, it's going to be time to clip the nails, trim them down a little bit so you don't scratch each other up too much. Okay? You're such a big girl, you know that? I'm a big hearty girl. I, I dare say that this, this girl is probably as big as the boy. Snapdragon. So here's Lily. Lily's also a silver charcoal, but she is super dark. She's as dark as Iris is. So again, it kind of reminds me of what you call smoke, which a smoke is a silver melanistic. I'm sorry. Yeah, silver melanistic. Otherwise thought of as basically a panther in which the spots are visible. So you can still see she's got mascara markings. Her face is not completely blacked out. So here's her, I think she might even be, would you, do you think she's a brown? I think she is. She might even be a scotch, maybe she might be a brown charcoal. Yeah. For sure. Because I could see a little bit, unless she's tarnished. So again, here's her rosettes. You can see them, they're visible, but that background color is not nearly as light as it is on Dahlia, so if you like the look of a smoke. We can do the hair follicle dust and see if we can. Then this girl's for you. So according to the hair follicle test, yeah, she looks brown to me. Yeah. Just a scotch. All right, so I'm going to reclassify Lily here as a brown. Let me put that in my notes. It's going to be brown. So one less silver charcoal. You are not special enough. You have to be a brown charcoal now. Sorry. Somebody will still love you, though. And here's our other resident brown charcoal, Petunia. You can definitely see the brown on her face for sure. Look at all of that brown. She's barely charcoal because, you know, you could see so much more color on her for sure. So let's check out her rosettes. So well spaced. Look at that. Perfect, mm -hmm. perfect black rosettes. They're so perfectly spaced. It's like they're painted on. Is this side going to repeat that? Mostly, yeah. It's not you don't always get both sides to be gorgeous, you know. Mm -hmm. Like uh, these rosettes are definitely not touching, so they're really well spaced. 
Well done. You're gorgeous. She worked hard on those. Petunia, I know, right? She Hand painted on them herself. on herself. Yeah. So. <laughs> Petunia. And Dahlia, so gorgeous. Dahlia is more submissive, I think. More, you know, kind of like let the others. <laughs> I think in this entire group, Dahlia and Snapdragon are the two best looking charcoal silvers. Not to say that Petunia's perfectly spaced rosettes aren't just gorgeous. And I love how Lily and Iris both look like panthers, just basically with visible rosettes. I mean, that is gorgeous. Definitely a different look. Black cat lovers will definitely like those two. 